This is our solution. <laughs> First, the, the problems. So we were talking about open data policy and the, con the consequences that it can have for a job search, uh, either in countries, uh, especially in countries where the unemployment rates are really high, then it becomes more of a, then it has more impact if you publish something on the internet years ago that doesn't really meet the grade of the job application you might have in mind. Um, we also thought that it would be necessary to uh, find a way to work truly anonymously, but still being able to reclaim what you've uh, shared in the, those documents later on. And in order to do this, it's not only necessary to um, being able to publish something anonymously, but also that your texts or your documents or videos or whatever are in some way scrambled so it doesn't pop up in, a, in either a, a text screening automate, uh, automation program or that they can still see, although she says it's from Joe Brown, it's actually from Janine Hoyter, the writer. Of Janine? Yes, Janine. Janine. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> and uh, so we need a soft to devise a software which one which can actually disguise writing patterns because now everybody wants to be able to distill patterns we want to scramble them back into a non anonymity and um, we all so ah and a possible easy low cost solution would be to work cooperatively to disguise the individual patterns either in text or the voice would be gold. We would have to do something about that. But in text, that might be uh, a solution to create a cooperative text. All right. I think that's, anybody have an addition to? I think we must discuss, we did discuss that. We, we didn't get to the point of how you claim it back later, but I think it's most important to Maybe. get it up there without yes. facing some heavy consequences. Mm -hmm. Big round of applause for you. Yay. Okay.